Hi, my name is Patrick and I work for Guidebook in our London office. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can create a schedule. Schedule is a very flexible feature and is a must-have for most guides. To start, I'll click into Schedule and I'll add a session by clicking Add Your First Session. To create a session, enter the name, the start and end time of your session, the description, and then hit Save. You can also import all your sessions in one go by hitting the Data Import button. Simply download one of the templates listed on this screen in XLS or CSV format. I'll open a template up and you'll see that the column names match the information needed when you are creating a session one by one. I'll upload a schedule that I made earlier. Just hit Select File and choose the schedule that you've made. And then hit Import Data. You can continue to edit your guide whilst the data imports. It's pretty quick though, you can see that all of the sessions have already imported. I can scroll down and click into any of these sessions. I can also create mini sub-schedules within my main schedule. We call these tracks. You can see I have a track for technical, summer orientation, meetings, sales and marketing. I'll pin technical to home. This means that when the user clicks on the technical button, they'll only see sessions that have been tagged with that track. I could also change the icon of a track if I want. Now I'm going to click into a session that I've uploaded. You can see that you can edit any of the information even after you've uploaded a session. I'm going to click links so I can link a speaker to my session. This will make it easy for my users to find the information about speakers. I'll also upload a thumbnail so this link stands out. I can go to feedback and link feedback forms as well. I can also go to Collaborate to share a link to edit this session. This means other people can help build my schedule. You can also upload PDFs and link them to any session. Simply go to Links and hit PDF. Name the PDF you want to upload. And then select the PDF you want to upload from your computer. You can choose if you want your PDF to be available online or offline. For large PDFs, we recommend online hosting so that your guide is nice and small and easy to download. You can also change the name of your link category to something a bit more descriptive. Finally, I'll show you how to export your schedule. Simply go back to your dashboard and select the little downward facing arrow next to your guide name. Then just pick the top option. That's always going to be your schedule. We'll then send that schedule directly to your email inbox and you can download it from there. Exporting is super useful for making edits to your schedule and also for cloning, reviewing and sharing.